Hey everybody, um, I am here in the basement of the East Library um, where I am going to talk to you a little bit today about um, binary code and what it is and um, then we'll show you how to make a little keychain or bracelet with your initials on it in binary. Um, so my name is Britt, I use she, her pronouns and I work for the Pikes Peak Library District in Young Adult Services. Let's get started. Okay, so let's talk about binary. So what is binary code? So basically all it is, is any, so, any sort of binary um, is a way to encode information um, using basically two digits. And normally in binary, you'll see it's zero and one, but if you choose to do our binary challenge, which I've linked to below, um, you will see that we've got binary in two different formats for you. So, um, but yeah, today I'm gonna mostly show you with zeros and ones. Um, and again, so a binary, a little piece of binary is called a binary digit or a bit. And each bit represents a piece of information, in this case, a character or a letter. So let's go ahead and um, get started with making those bracelets. If you wanna learn a little bit more about binary code, check out the link below. Okay, so these are the materials that you're gonna need to make um, your binary bracelet or keychain. You're gonna need scissors, you're gonna need some sort of core, you're gonna need beads, pony beads in two different colors, and that's where the binary comes from, right? Um, and then if you're gonna make it into a keychain, you need a keychain ring. So um, I chose to do the letters B and V. Um, so that's B is in Bravo and V is in Victor. And what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna go ahead and line the beads up and I'm gonna use green for zero and then blue for one so that I can just go ahead and put it on um, the string. Alrighty, so we're gonna start with B and then I'll do B. So then what you're gonna do is you're gonna double knot, you're gonna tie a little double knot at the end of your thing. And you wanna give yourself some room um, because the ends are what you'll use to tie off on your keychain or your bracelet. All right, so I've got a double knot here, and then, you know, you can think about if, you know, if you want this to be the top, but, um, cool. So, or if this is gonna be the top. So I'm gonna make this the top of mine, so I'm just gonna start from here. And then put the beads on. And some of y'all are probably master bead people, but as you can tell, I am not. So I am doing it this way, which feels like maybe not the best method, but whatever. All right, so now I've got that. And again, I need to just tie a little knot so that I can keep these two pieces of binary separate. Um, and if you're like, how did she figure out what the binary was? Um, we've got a decoder key in the binary challenge, which we've linked below. And I encourage you to go through the binary challenge. It's pretty challenging. And we have actually two different forms of binary for you to work with in it. So check that out um, to get the key. All right, so that is our B. So again, I just tied a knot on the other end. And now I'm gonna repeat the same process with B. So again, I'm using green beads for zeros. And then I'm gonna just use the blue beads for ones, just like I did before. So whatever you did on the top, you wanna do on the, the second letter as well. Sweet, okay, there's that. And again, I'm just putting the beads on the thing the cord. That's the word I'm searching for here. Ta-da! More beads on the cord. And then let's tie that off too. And we're giving you enough cord, you could also make this a necklace really easily if, you, if that's also an option. So if you're doing this as a take and make library. Okay, and that's it. I've got something that says BV right there, BV. So um, now I can either tie it off as a bracelet or I can tie it to this keychain. So you're just gonna use the same knot as before and you're gonna do kind of like I said, whichever one is your preference. And that is today's nice, easy little um, project. So hopefully you learned a little bit about binary. 
Um, and go ahead and check out some of our other tween twist videos or subscribe for more content like this.